meeting people, <laughs> have you fun. That, that's perfect. That's yeah. it. Tinker Forge. That's it. All, All right. So I'm, I'm here with Sven Rupert at the JCrete on conference. How you doing, man? Yeah, fine. So we, we see each other everywhere else in the world, but I think this is the first time on a vacation resort yeah, sure. <laughs> where we've spent time <laughs> oh, together. Javaland? Javaland? Yes, yeah, that was fun. This was it's a vacation me. resort. Uh, yeah. Not so good at this one. Yeah, <laughs> here we go. Okay. A little closer. Better? Yeah, okay. awesome. Yeah, so what was your favorite part of the week here? The favorite part is, um, yeah, we have enough time to talk and uh, the sessions are not too early. So uh, we had enough time for breakfast. And okay, so g give me a discussion <laughs> which you, you learned something new that you didn't know before you came here to JCrete. Something new? Oh, I learned a lot about bytecode. <laughs> 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 I learned a lot about bytecode. Uh, yeah, so um, maybe um, a part of this uh, I'm able Learn to... Learning about be better techniques for inlining your code? Uh, well... Ways of analyzing your GC logs? Mm, a little bit. Uh, I know what I have to learn now. <laughs> <So> <laughs> <laughs> I, I learned a lot about uh, new techniques and, and uh, tools that I have to... Yeah, I, I try it if I'm at home. Nice, so nice. You're gonna have really you're gonna you're gonna you're soon gonna be um, giving performance lessons to your coworkers. Um, <laughs> well, uh, maybe next year. Yeah. Okay, that's <laughs> good. Day, See, you've learned that you don't know enough about it to teach other yeah, people yeah, yet. Definitely, yeah. definitely. So yeah, that's the mistake I've made. <laughs> <laughs> Says Kirk Pepperdine, our official heckler. Yes. So um, Heckling. yeah. So also, um, we're gonna be doing some embedded hacking tomorrow. So yeah, do you have any ideas for like projects you've been itching to do? Well, what I want to try is um, combine the stuff I was bringing with me with your stuff. Nice. So maybe we, we could do it. Yeah. This, uh, yeah, well, let's see what, what we could do with the Raspberries and Tinkerforge and your Lego Mindstorm. Yeah, yeah and we're going to have a, a lot of hardware to, to hack with. And, you know, with the brain capital in this, in this little building, this little resort here, mm -hmm. um, I'm, I'm kind of scared. I'm scared about my um, my stream pausing randomly and um, not capturing this perfectly. Yeah, well, but I think we <laughs> we have enough uh, yeah big childs to to play with all this. Yeah, stuff. it should be, should be really cool. So I have nice. nine Lego Mindstorm sets, uh, okay. twenty Raspberry Pis, and a whole load of miscellaneous hardware for us to play with. Plus whatever you guys brought. So the Tinker Forge. Tell us a little yeah. bit more about Tinker Forge. I'm Tinker curious. Forge. Well, it's uh, something like Lego, but with electronic stuff. You could put it all together and then immediately start programming with Java 8. Okay, and if you want to hook it up to a Raspberry Pi, do you just hook it up to the I2C I or the GPIO yeah, bus, USB. or you use USB? USB, USB, USB to or hook wireless. It up? Wireless. USB or wireless. Wireless. Yes. So uh, it's, it's the same, it's an IP How protocol. How do you power it? Um, if you have not so many elements, uh, you could use USB, otherwise, you. Okay. To need an external hook up device. an external power source to yeah. power it. Cool. So and it's kind of plug and play. You what just are the cool things that you've seen people do with it? Um, the most coolest thing you've seen people do with the, it. The, the really cool thing is that you have uh, sensors and actors for nearly everything. You could put them in a few minutes together and try what's going on with, uh, with all the data. So you don't have to prepare yourself for hours. You only have an idea putting all together yeah. and trying. Mm -hmm. And hard and software is completely open source. So if you really want to do later something with this, you could do everything. You can extend the hardware by yourself if you want. And, uh, but nice. for the first prototyping, it's really good. So am, am I going to see you at Jake Creed in 2015? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> sure, immediately. And probably, and probably several other events between now and then. Yeah. All right, Absolutely. thanks very much, okay. Sven. Thanks.